Hello everyone, here I am again today with a new activity. So I actually stopped by and bought new plants and because I have such limited rooms, I would still like to have a mini gardens of my own. So let's check it out. The first plant that I started working on is called the Hebe Pinocchio plant and forgive me if I pronounce it incorrectly but um, this plant was actually inspired by a Thai plant as shown in picture but because I couldn't find this specific plant nearby I had to find another plant that is similar and that one was the most similar one despite the differences in the color and a bit of the texture of the plant. And now I'm putting these gardening soil onto a pot that is much longer but you probably can't really see because the box is kind of blocking it. Now that that step is done, I'm going to take out the cilantro plants that I got from this farm and plant them into the soil that I just added on. And because I love, love, love cilantro, and you have no idea how much of the cilantro that I've actually eaten, so I actually ended up buying six plants of cilantro plus the smaller seed in a package as well. I ended up taking my gloves off and put it back on and taking it off because I felt like having it on was a little bit difficult especially trying to deal with such fragile cilantro plants so with not having a glove on on my other hand it helps it better and I actually don't need to worry about destroying these tiny teeny plants Next, I have the African Marigold and this plant is the exact same plant that I would be able to find in Thailand. And the meaning behind this plant is that it sim symbolizes luck, you know, such as luck in your career path and luck in life. I don't know if you're able to see it, but if you can in the video, these two flowers are the same type of flowers but one has a darker tone color and the other one has a soft yellow tone color which is pretty cool to see because you know they're the exact same plants but just has a slightly different color
So I realized that in the video there is a part missing of me planting the ghost pepper and the Trinidad scorpion which is located to the right side of the pot and apparently there's another type of chili plant that is way spicier than those two plants but unfortunately they were out of it today and hopefully I'll be able to find it the next time Let's go and take a look at my finishing products. Here we got the cilantro plant as well as the tiny seed of cilantro. Next, we've got the ghost pepper and the Trinidad scorpion. Here's a closer look. And they're supposed to be really, really spicy. And after that, we got aloe because I love aloe. The next one is African marigold. And then we've got the Hebe Pinocchio and then another African marigold. So, ta-da!